The quest for oil has become more complex in the last years. The hydrocarbon reservoirs has become more difficult to reach and more difficult to produce. In order to overcome those problems, we need to understand how rocks and fluids interact in the subsurface. We have developed and we have installed a worldwide class in laboratory here in Repsol that allows us to understand and map the rocks interaction from the nano world to the micro world to the meso world into the reservoir world. Sharno 2 is our digital detective. It's uh, about transforming the real rock into a digital model. It's uh, trying to transform the grains and the pores into numbers. We need to image the rock. We make 3D models of the rocks using advanced X-ray techniques. And we make 2D models of the rocks using really high-tech electron beams. In that way, we can access information that otherwise cannot be accessed, and we can understand in a deeper way the interaction of the pores and the fluid. Digital technology can be stored forever. So, as a non-destructive technique, we can simulate one process in one rock and predict how the behavior of the reservoir is going to be in 10 years, for example. And then in 10 years, we can assess the same rock in the digital world and redo the test in order to enhance our knowledge of the reservoir and predict how it's going to behave in the next 10 years. This technology is non-destructive, so we can obtain the information, store it, and keep it for a long period of time. I see this technology transforming all the information that's coming from the rocks and the actual test into the digital world. So we can store all this information there. So it will help us to do everything faster and cheaper than what we're doing now. Digital technology is giving us knowledge that a few years ago we don't have. So with this new knowledge, we can perform new physical models that is giving us the insight on how to produce reservoirs that otherwise cannot be produced. In Repsol, we are committed to develop this technology because we truly believe in technology and how this technology is going to be the engine of new developments in our exploration success.